Standard 8 West, we love the chance to showcase local artists, and we've been so blessed to have events like Art Prize that also help to highlight the local talent. Our next guest, Steve Kurtz, works magic with metal and has an up upcoming exhibition in Grand Haven. Steve, you've got two fantastic mm -hmm. pieces that are on display in our studio today. Tell us about your work. Okay, uh, these pieces right here are uh, a series of uh, steel sculptures that I started uh, really a couple of years ago, and I wanted to sort of explore some ideas I had that, you know, were you know very things I have an interest in as far as uh, they related to nature, and I wanted to have a, a series of pieces that all related to one another, and they kind of look like drawings that came out of my sketchbook, basically. Mm. That's so interesting. And, and we were talking earlier about how do you start one of these? You have an art background, obviously, mm -hmm. but how do you just go from nothing to beautiful uh, pieces? Uh, it's tough. It's, uh, you know, it's hard to begin with these things as, as, it, as it is. But these kind of, they, they, to me, they kind of look like a drawing in space, mm -hmm. you know, a three-dimensional drawing, like a line drawing. And, you know, there's trial and error. Sometimes you start a piece, it doesn't really work out. But these... Uh, you know, as making these things, you start with one piece, and you see where it goes. And you have actually an exhibition coming up in Grand Haven where people can actually come and see these pieces and a bunch of other great uh, objects that you've created through the years. Tell us about the, the upcoming okay. exhibition. Uh, the show opens at the Firebun Gallery in Grand Haven, and it's on, uh, uh, the gallery house would be on Saturday and Wednesday. The opening is on Friday, February 4th, 6 to 9, and I'll have five pieces in the gallery itself. And I also have a piece in front of the gallery that was part of the Grand Haven Art Walk. And there's even a piece in Central Park across the street, which is left over from Art Walk. Wow, that's exciting. You must be so excited as an artist in the Grand Haven area to see what is really happening with the art scene and the appreciation people are paying to it. Oh, yes. It's nice to have some support and people you know, showing interest in it. And we actually have a few more of your pieces uh, in pictures on the screen. You want to tell us a little bit about those? Okay, this piece right here was... Uh, this is actually currently in front of the Firebound Gallery in Green Haven, where the show will be. And that was, uh, that current picture shown right now is, uh, was at the Holland Area Arts Council for a show last year. And that is a big fiberglass top on a steel base. Now this piece right here is actually one that will be in the show. And it is uh, another one, it's a line drawing in space. And it's sort of, some people think it looks like some kind of creature. <laughs> I don't know. It has but, personality to it. Yeah. When I look at these from not being an artist, it, everyone just kind of, it speaks to itself. Right. <laughs> yeah, I know. Now, I, my, my pieces don't have titles, and people always want to know, what's the title? What does it mean? Like, well, that's for you to decide. And oh, okay. I don't want to give away the whole, whole story there. <laughs> and so, what we're seeing on the screen now? These are some kayaks I make. I also make uh, kayaks, and uh, they're made out of wood. And they're, I really started making one because I wanted one. And then I realized that, you know, maybe I want a different boat. And then maybe somebody else wants one. So and those were a lot of fun to make. You just have the complete art background because you were mentioning that you did paintings as well. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. I still paint some. And I was thinking of actually putting some paintings in this upcoming show. But they don't relate real well, these sculptures. So well, that's a, maybe next time. That sounds great. Well, Steve, you're a very creative guy. And if people are interested, along the lakeshore in Grand Haven, a great place. Heated sidewalks this time of the year in that the downtown area, which is really yeah. nice. I don't Love let it. the crazy snow and cold weather scare you away. That's right. Thank you very <laughs> much. Thank you very well, much. Thanks for coming nice. here to be with us today. We'll be right back. Are you West? Ha, 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 ha.